this is my um, battery box for my boat. Um, I had this laying around. I'm a photographer, so I had this laying around. This box laying around that I wasn't using anymore. Um, this is from Harbor Freight. Um, but I built this box for my boat so it can power my trolling motor and my fish finder and all my other accessories that I have for my boat. Um, as you can see, it's, um, I have a 12 volt plug here and then I have two PD um, USB-C ports, a regular USB port. The, US, um, the PDs are 30 watts a piece, so I can have up to 60 watts on that side, at least for that. This here is for my trolling motor plug, to power my portable motor, my trolling motor here. And this is the plug for my fish finder, little amps fish finder. Um, this box is smart. All of these parts are smart. Um, so I can tell Siri from my phone to turn off each individual one of these if I want to. Um, it's perfect for hands free for the boat, so I don't got to worry about pushing buttons and pulling the plugs out and all that stuff. I can do it all the way from the, right from the seat of my boat. I have to get up and just talk to my phone. Um, this is a um, 100 amp hour battery, 12 volt. Um, it has Bluetooth as well on, this, on the battery. So I can see the levels and stuff for my, um, for my phone as well. Um, low temp sensor for winter time. Because also, this is going to be, um, it also is going to be um, used for home backup as well. So um, this will be in my house at all times. Um, the power ever goes out. I do have a 12 volt refrigerator for camping, which I can load a lot of my food into it if the power goes out and the power from this for days. Um, I can charge my phones if I want to, cameras. Um, this, is, this is very useful. I mean, 100 amp hours is a lot of power, believe it or not. There's a lot of power. This, this, I can power a lot with this for um, for emergency purposes. So it's gonna be used for dual dual purposes. Um, I mainly built it for my my boat, but I also gonna be able to use it for um, home backup system as well. Um, I also have this battery here, which is um, this is a 36 volt battery. But I also bought this. This is my boat as well for this motor. This is my Alpo electric motor. But I also um, have this step down converter to um, step down this battery from 36 to 12 volt. So I can use this for um, home backup system as well in case for emergencies. It, was, it has a lot of power. I mean, it's 19, um, 1900 watt hours. So this, this can power a lot of stuff for a while. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to be powering like washers and dryers, but for like self charging phones. Um, DC refrigerators, which I have one right here. That's it, DC refrigerator. It can power this. That battery can power this refrigerator for a week, easily. This is this only draws 25 watts. It's small, but I also have a big one in the house. Um, it made made by Iceco, um, and that's uh, I believe it's a 60 or 59 quart, which can hold a lot of food. So I mean, between these two. I mean, I can run it for a while, and I think that one's only only pulls like 35 watts. So, I mean, with these two batteries, I can charge up phones. I can have a LED light. My my living room lights LED. It plugs in, and that can that only uses like 10 watts. I mean, so you think I can use these batteries for a lot? But they're for my boat. But I also have them set up so I can use them for um, backup purposes as well, emergency purposes. But this closes up like a suitcase. This one's more portable and more manageable because. It's not as heavy as the other one, but okay, it's your case. It's, it's what it is. <laughs> All the ports on the side. Well, camping, you know, using for camping, little camping with the kids and stuff. I mean, it just this is perfect. I'm thinking about building another one. I should have two for camping. 
because um, obviously my kids are old enough to have their own tent now, so I'll build them one as well so they can charge their like, tablets and phones. You know, kids, my kids are talking about bringing their VRs to the camp, and I'm like, what the heck? And I also have a, um, I have a Starlink as well, so this will power my Starlink up as well. So it's, it's, it's a dope, I mean, it's, this is used for multiple things, but it was mainly, mainly, mainly built for my boat. This is it. Homemade power box. If you have any questions on how to build one of these, or if you have any questions on what you need to build one of these, um, you can email me. I will leave my email in the description. Uh, but it's, it wasn't. It was, it was. It was hard, but it wasn't too hard to build. So. All right, that's it. I just want to show you my power box, my boat. Catch y'all later. Bye.